Hello everyone. In this problem, the second and the fifth terms of a geometric sequence are given and we are to find the value of the third term. Recall that the geometric sequence is a sequence where any term divided by the previous term is a constant. This constant is called the common ratio of the sequence and is represented by R. This common ratio can be found by dividing any term in the sequence by the previous term. So given A1 is the first term, then the second term can be created by multiplying the common ratio R by A1. And the third term can be obtained by multiplying the second term by R. And the fourth term can be obtained by multiplying A3 by the common ratio R. And the final term or the nth term can be obtained by multiplying the first term by R to the power of N minus one. So in general, the explicit formula for the nth term of a geometric sequence is given by a1 multiplied by r to the power of n minus one. Suppose a1 to a5 are the five terms of the given sequence for the problem. Now, we know that a2 or the second term is 10 and the fifth term is 80. So we substitute. To find a3 or the third term, we can multiply the second term or 10 by R or the common ratio. But the common ratio is unknown. So we need to find a way to relate the second term to the fifth term. So if we multiply R by 10, we get A3. And then if you multiply 10 by R square, we get A4. And we multiply 10 by R cube, we get the fifth term or 80. So we can set up an equation relating the second term to the fifth term. Now we have 10 multiplied by r cubed equals 80. We can divide both sides by 10, then we get r cubed equals 8. Then we cubic root both sides to obtain r to be 2. So the common ratio of this sequence is equal to 2. Finally, to find term 3, or the third term, we need to multiply the second term by one common ratio. A3 equals 10 multiplied by 2. So the third term will be 20. Thanks for watching.